Takashi Six Nine is the troll of 2018. He's trolling everybody. That's why 50 so co-signed. Like 50's the goat troll. I'm, yeah, I think he's trolling like. <laughs> He's, he owns the bridge. <laughs> he's, he's the troll under the bridge. Yeah. Yeah. The troll the <laughs> Who's crossing my bridge? <laughs> <laughs> Who's he trolling? Takashi just, I think he trolled two people this week. The boxer, Adrian Broner. He's fighting Saturday in uh, New York City. And uh, Takashi told him that he has to check in when he comes to New York. <laughs> 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 he, he told him that he will bet him 300000 that he will lose the fight. So this guy is cutting weight. He's angry and he's got Takashi trolling him. So I wouldn't be surprised if, if the guy gets knocked out and, and like because of all the shit that he's like, he's just like frustrated with Takashi. Is he really paying that much attention to him? Yes, because he also put 300,000 up against Takashi. He did it. Yeah. That he's gonna win the fight. That he's gonna win the fight. The that was said he's gonna lose the fight. <laughs> oh, man. So how much of that? How much? How much of that do you think was fifty getting in his head saying? I, I don't know, man. Like that's a fifty, 50 move. Right there. Oh yeah, that's anything, such a fifty move. Fifty cosigns anything that's gonna cause controversy. Yeah. So but, we all know, like, we don't need to talk about his freestyle because we all know that it was horrible. <laughs> but he wanted it to be horrible. I didn't even watch it. it did he want he it? Because at the end he was like, cut. Like, oh shit, that sucked. Cut. <laughs> that's what it sounded like to me. <laughs> no, no, no. The guy is smart, man. He knows it's gonna, people are gonna view it. Maybe it is smart because I viewed it and now I'm talking about it. <laughs> yeah. But what I wanted to say is to your point about him being a great artist. I, I, I never said that. Or a good artist or you're a fan of his. I like his music, yeah. Let's rewind the tape and what exactly did you say? Hold up, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> I think he said he likes his music. He likes I, his I music. It. I didn't so say having, he's a great artist. I didn't so having say said that, say the it. latest song that he released, I took it in. I don't know the title. We'll research that. Gotti? But I, yeah, Gotti. Thank you. And the song was actually, I thought it was okay. It was pretty good. It okay. wasn't his usual yelling style. But what I didn't like about the video is he's giving out money. Like a dollar bill to everybody. You didn't, didn't like about that? Didn't Drake already do that? No. Nope. Drake did that and instead of a dollar bill, it was like a stack. Right. Which is my point. Like yeah. if you're going to do something a man already did, do it better. you need to... Wanna up it and do better. I, I think just the it. fact that he's giving out money to poor people is, is good enough. Bro, well, nah, he, he no. did that when he was in Dominican Republic. Yeah, he was, he was out there of the with country. DJ Academics. Yeah. He went to, he, they were going to film a, a music video by the pool. This is 50 had an interview with him. It's really good, actually. Okay. Mm. And he talks about it and he's like, I didn't realize there were these levels of, of poverty. Like, this was third world. Right. So instead of buying this radio that he went to the city to get, he's out there giving money to kids. That's yeah. the only thing he knows how to do. Puts and in. don't get me wrong, I commend him for doing that. And anytime you can help someone out, I think it's great. But the fact that he did it after Drake released his God Plans video and Drake's handing out stacks of money, you're going to come and just give a kid a dollar. But he doesn't have Drake money. Planned. I don't think it was planned. It was impromptu, man. Mm -hmm. like, the other thing is, it's like, it's like when you buy it, you do something nice for someone, and then you go make a Facebook post about it. You know what I mean? Like, you should just do nice things to do nice things. It's right, do to get public recognition. Right, which is why I didn't understand why they put that in the video. That's my only point. Like, yeah. I don't think mm -hmm. that that needed to be in the video unless it's what you're saying. He's this genius who everything that he does is like strategically planned. I think so people like me are going to talk about him and be like, yo, fuck, this guy gave out like dollar bills in his video. Yeah. And I don't know that it was a dollar bill. It was probably a hundred hundreds, dollar bill. Hundreds. Right? Yeah. But I just think it's pale in comparison to like handing out a stack of money versus like one piece of paper. I just, I just think that that part didn't need to be in the video. So I liked this song and I started to be like, okay, this guy's all right. Then I saw the end of the video. I'm like, no, you're a douchebag still. <laughs> That's what I thought. Hmm. I'm I sorry. I don't trying. think he's a horrible artist. I think his troll game's heavy. Mm -hmm. But I respect him on both those levels. But I mean, the petty <laughs> shit, whatever that stuff is, you know. I don't know. I don't know enough about it. I know what he said on Breakfast Club, but that's not, it's two sides of every story. I don't really respect him as an individual. You know what I mean? But... His yeah. troll game's heavy, and his music isn't horrible. Like, I can fuck with some of his tunes. Like, I got any tunes, I... Right. 